Hello, today is September 25th, 2019. Welcome to HGB News. I'm Nicasia Morales. And I'm Langston Jones. Here's what's going on at HHX. Today, the college, today is College Education Day. Seniors, today you have the opportunity to complete your college applications for Ivy Tech, Purdue Northwest, and Indiana University Northwest, free of charge. All of the representatives are located in the Bricky Stop. Please stop by and complete your submit and application today during lunch. Don't forget to grab some Nelson's chicken before the homecoming game over versus Munster. Buy online, buy, buy online here at HHS Chicken Dinner to Eventbrite.com or come into the athletic office or student services. There will be food, music, games, and raffles. Eat before the game or take it home. We will be located behind the school at the entrance to the football field. $10 per ticket includes chicken, side, and a drink. Domestic Violence Awareness Month it is time for us to honor all those impacted by domestic violence and sexual assault. St. Jude House 24th Annual Candlelight Vigil is on Tuesday, October 1st, 2019 from 5.30 to 7 p.m. Please join us at this important event to show your support. Guest speakers, music, and complimentary refreshments will be provided. Environmental Club will meet on Monday, September 30th after school in room 2203. There will be a Spanish Club meeting this Thursday, September 26th, at the Hobart Librarium. So come and join us for coffee and conversation in Spanish. And now we tune to Brendan for our sports updates. Congrats to our August Brookie Athletes of the Month, Addison Metz and Bobby Babcock. Athletics will be hosting the Purple and Gold Panic 3K Walk and Run on Sunday, September 29th. Register by September 4th to get a run kit. Applications available in the Media Center. More info can be found at www.hobart.k12.in.us slash purplegoldpanic. Also on Twitter, at purplegoldpanic. And for the boys' soccer team, on Saturday featured a rematch of last year's IHSAA sectional opener, Hobart taking on Portage, and it was an amazing game, ending in a one-to-one -one tie. Back to you, Nicasio. Thanks, Brendan. October 2nd, Ms. Bumley is hosting an on-the-table conversation. It will be an informal conversation during your lunch hour. It will provide dessert to share and connect around our experiences living and working in North, Northwest Indiana. Up next, we have a very own Mercedes Brown for what's happening, HHS. Thank you, Nicasio, and good morning, HHS. The season is upon us. October is just around the corner. The spooky community is buzzing with excitement with the many opportunities opening up. For example, Haunted Hills Hospital is opening this weekend on September 27th from 7 p.m. to 10 p.m. every Friday, Saturday, and Sunday this October with live actors and vendors for entertainment and fun while you prepare for the main event. For more information on that, you can go to their website at www.hauntedhillshospital.com or you can visit the Haunted Hills Facebook page Along with that, Inktober is on its way for many artists. If you don't know what Inktober is, it's an art challenge that is made to strengthen your ink skills within 31 days with 31 drawings. So if you love art and want to improve your work or just join in on the fun, check out their website at inktober.com. Thank you for tuning in. Now back to Nicasio. Thanks, Mercedes. It looks like a lot of fun. Hope our high school is temp upcoming events for clubs and activities. For more information on that, we tune to Ava and Aiden. Hobart High School is offering free tutoring for students on Mondays and Wednesdays. The sessions are conducted by certified staff members and are available for students needing assistance with math and English. Transportation is only for those students attending for the after school tutoring program. Students, if you like to share your writings, stories, and poems in a small group where you are not judged or like to act out impromptu prompts, then the HHS Writers Club is just the thing for you. We will meet today, Wednesday, September 25th, and light snacks are provided. We will meet from 3.30 to 3.45. We are recycling, but only put paper products in the blue recycle bins. Recycling will be picked up Wednesday mornings. Thank you for all your help. 
To the class of 2020, are you interested in, in, in attending Indiana University Bloomington for the 2020-2021 school year? Are you a first-generation college seeker? To find out how to recommend for the group scholarship at IU, check your 12th grade Canvas page and read the announcements that Ms. Torres posted. There you will find a link with more information on the scholarship. She will set one-on-one -on -one meetings with her when you email her. Holbert High School Boys and Girls Bowling will be hosting Saturday Night Bingo at the Moose Lodge Saturday, October 12th. Doors open at 5 p.m. Bingo starts at 7 p.m. and tickets are $10 per person. Food and beverages may be purchased. You have to be 18 to play. Also, make sure to check out the new Spirit Wear shop at Hobart HS Spirit Wear 19.itemorder.com slash sale. Key Club's annual shoe drive has started. Please bring all your donations to your sixth period class. And the class with the most pairs of shoes brought will be awarded a little surprise. All the shoes will be collected today, Wednesday, September 25th. Treats will fall on September 27th. Shoes can be in any condition, but they must be a pair. In honor of College Go Week, each of the each morning of this week will have a college-related trivia question. If you have the opportunity to submit an answer during your lunch and lunch, and after sea lunch, we will draw for a prize. There is a table in the Great Hall where answers will be submitted, and the winner will be announced during the afternoon announcements. Back to you, Langston and Nicasio. Important safety tip. Please use the sidewalk on north side of 10th Street. This means you should safely cross 10th Street to get to the sidewalk. Many members are concerned and want to keep you safe, as do we. When you must be on the non-sidewalk side of 10th, be sure to use the bike lane and watch traffic. That there, folks, concludes this edition of HTV News. Make sure to like and subscribe to the Hobart High School, t rate school Radio and TV channel. Remember, Remember only, only the best, best for HHS, HHS. And, and have a fantastic, fantastic day, everyone. everyone.